Angels. How does it feel to be dancing? Blessing. It's a blessing, man. Blessing. Glory to God, man. Man above. But we ain't we ain't done yet. I mean, we still got you know something to prove. We still have that chip on our shoulder. Um, we happy to be here, but we want to win. You know, in the tournament, make a deep run. So. Um, it's it's a blessing, you know, to to see that, you know, my faith and my hard work, you know, paid off and I get to spend it, you know, with the guys that I love the most, um, in my final season. Um, it's just a blessing. I mean, you know, I'm gonna take it like one game at a time. There's nothing different than playing on the road, you know, in the Big Twelve. Um, that's how I'm I'm gonna handle it and look at it. But, you know, March is different, um, and I'm just gonna embrace it, you know, and have fun, you know, through this whole journey. Um, I mean, I always say thank God just for giving me this opportunity. Um, it just it means a lot just knowing all the hard work, everything I've been through, fighting through adversity, and the guys trusting in me, um, trusting my work, and just trusting in them, telling them my goals, and we all just stood together and just figured it out and how to get to the tournament. But again, ranked this high, I mean, it's really a blessing just I'm trying to finish off and get a trophy. But just grateful to be here. And was that the vision that Coach Tang sold you on? Yeah, I mean, it definitely was a vision. I mean, he told me day one he wasn't trying to rebuild his program. He wanted to win right away, and that's why I wanted to come in. I mean, it was the toughest toughest conference in college basketball, um, the best basketball player here, and I wanted to showcase my skills through this conference and just believe in Coach Tang, where he had. What's the mood kind of been like for you guys in the last couple of days since you got back? Oh, you just been – you got it. I feel like the move been good. You know, we had a fantastic practice today, man. We all competed at a high level. I feel like we got our swagger back. After them two games that we lost um, on the road, I just feel like we came in, we executed in film, and we got on the court, and we just having fun, energy, and we just playing together. I feel like we're going to take that to the March Madness. How much more do you guys feel like you have? I mean, we have a lot. I mean, you know, guys are not done yet, you know, just individually and from a team standpoint. I feel like, you know, getting there is a blessing, but winning and going on and advancing to, to different um, rounds is even more important. Um, and we want to, you know, just, you know, create good memories that we could remember for a lifetime. Um, this is a special group of guys um, that, that we have on this team. You know, we all like each other. We all love each other. Um, we, we want the best for each other. So I feel like, you know, just taking, you know, that, that practice that we had today and that energy and just, you know, going on with it throughout March Madness, I feel like will be key and vital to our success. I mean, big time, man. I always dreamed of, as a kid, just playing in Madison Square Garden. I looked up to Kemba Walker growing up um, and what he's done in the garden. But I have to focus on one game at a time. You can't look too far ahead um, because that's when you get beat. You know, you got to take it one day, one game at a time. And whenever that that happens, then, you know, I talk about it more. This is potentially a little bit premature, but have you guys done any advanced scouting? You got any paperwork, folders of information on my Nah. 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 Yeah, North not too Um, I mean I wanna say a big crowd, but just my main circle that I've been around, um, all my close friends and families, sisters, siblings. So I, I mean I expect them all to come to the game. We got, yeah. we got practice earlier. Yeah, so. practice. Probably, you know, just chill, talk about, you know, this feeling, trying to embrace it together. Um, and from here on out, we just got to focus on winning. Uh, we know where our opponent is, so we got to do everything in our power to make sure that we are prepared and, you know, 
ready for the game. Coach Tang, as soon as you guys saw, you go from three seed to Coach Tang, right? The coaches say any of you guys bring that happen? Man, everybody was just happy. I mean, everybody was just thankful to even be in this position. Um, looking back at, you know, where we started from to now, um, the coaches, you know, just congratulated us for all our hard work and, you know, just just sticking together, man. We just, we just, they just loved us so, from the very start. So. Did you guys have any idea where you ended up uh, holding a number three as opposed to dropping four? Any difference to you guys? Is that maybe more validation of what you did over the course of a full season? Um. I mean, yeah, I feel like we, we played like the big games. We had showed up early in the season, and we got some big wins to help us out throughout this um, selection. So I feel like um, we showed that we can compete at a high level with the, one of the best teams out here. And so you got to carry it over in March Madness, just stay together and just have fun out there. What were you hearing guys cheering from the other side? Was that because you maybe felt you might drop to a four seed and you were happy to see that you weren't going to be one? Um, we we. we we were just playing around because we thought we were going to be in New York. So whenever, you know, Albany came up and we didn't see our name selected, we, we just said, oh, but you know, now we know who we play. Uh, it's going to be it's going to be fun. It's going to be a fun journey. Can you spend on what you guys pay attention to bracketology at this time of the year? You log it on ESPN and different websites to see where you guys are projected? No. Uh -huh. No, no. It's actually a one-two uh, because we started out with two guys, me and Ish, and then it just leads on to everybody that we have on the roster. So we had crazy faith from the from the jump, me and Ish, and you know we did everything and anything in our in our power to get guys here. And now to see that we we selected in Selection Sunday is just a testament to our crazy faith. Six games of experience in the tournament. Is that right? Yes, I made it all the way to Elite Eight. Yes, sir. Uh, how key is that experience and what can you do to convey to guys and how much do you just kind of put a little bit out there and then shut up? So, I mean, it, uh, going to the tournament is all about having a connection, going one to know, not thinking ahead, one game at a time, and just focusing on the main thing, keeping the main thing, main thing. Everybody show up, we're going to show up. March Madness, anything can happen. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> <laughs> For real. We used to watch this growing up as kids. We back. Now we here.